I'm Sarah and welcome back to my channel Rosie Home. So today I have a cleaning haul for you. I have been to Wilco and B&M and I've picked up a few cleaning supplies. I have been feeling so inspired to clean my house lately. I've been following Mrs Hinch Home. I don't know if you've heard of her but she has blown up over on Instagram. She is doing so so well and I'm addicted to her stories I must say. That and Carly J Drake who is another one of my faves. She is on YouTube so I link her channel down below as well as Instagram. She is doing a 30 day cleaning challenge. I'm not hardcore enough to join in with the pace of her cleaning challenge but I am making steps to give areas of my home a deep clean before the new school year. So the first item is a Mrs Hinch classic and it is this Carpet Fresh Cleaner 101. It's literally just a spray that you just spray on your carpets and it makes them smell really nice. It says it gets rid of pet odours, cooking smells and tobacco. We have no doors in our house downstairs so the smells do get all around the house. My bedrooms gets a bit stinky when I'm changing her bum and stuff. The smell just does linger in the room and I'm finding this so nice just to go over the carpets. I wouldn't use it every day but I think when there is a lingering smell this is just perfect. I've used it this morning and every time I've gone out into the lounge and the bedrooms they smell really nice and Rosalie liked to help me do this. She goes and spray this on the floor and loved seeing the foam go all over the floor. That was £1.89 and I got that from B&M. On the carpet theme, the next item I got was this carpet cleaner. I've used this Dr. Beckman's carpet stain remover before and I love it. I mean, it's so good for if you have got have little accidents or little wee-wee stains or anything like that or the kids spill a drink, it's really, really good. I love that it has this brush, so you literally just squeeze a bit out and then you rub it in with the brush. It's really good. I got this from Wilkinson's and this was £3.50. I always like to have this in the cupboard, so as soon as it runs out, I buy it again. The next item is a vanish spray. I swear by this stuff, like Maeve gets her clothes stained or Frozy gets her dinner down her top. This is a lifesaver. I use this all the time. I just run out, so I purchase a new one. This was an extra big bottle. I've never had the one this big before. This was in Wilkinson's and this was £6. It is really expensive but I know this works so that's why I've got it. I am going to try a cheaper alternative because this is quite expensive but for now I couldn't find another one so I stocked up on this one. I got some Viacal. This really is the best thing for lime scale for going around your taps and things. I've used this in the past before. We just ran out, we didn't have any, so I got some of this to go around my bathroom taps. This is another Mrs. Hinch purchase. It is the Toilet Duck Fresh Discs, and I am loving this. It smells so nice. I've already used it, so it's all been opened um, because I've put one of these in each one of my toilets and every time you go to the toilet, it smells really nice. I'm loving it. It's so, it's nice because there's not a cage to get all disgusting and filled with germs. It's just a little disc of gel, which then sets and every time you flush your toilet, it makes your toilet smell nice. So I'm loving this. And this was £3.50, so not too expensive at all. Um, I've done all three of my toilets and there's still loads left. So I think I'll get lots of uses out of this. The next item I purchased, was this kettle descaler. I haven't done mine for ages. And Carly, who I was talking about earlier, recently did hers and I was like, oh, I really should do mine. So I bought this. This was one pound from Wilkinson's. It was really easy to use. You literally just boil the kettle, take the sachet out, pop it in the boiled water for 10 to 15 minutes, leave it to do its thing and then rinse. It's so easy to use and it's made such a difference to my kettle. The next item I got was some Sephora. This features heavily in my haul. I've used the Sephora for a while and I do really love it. The smell is second to none. Like you just feel so clean when you use it because the smell is so fresh. Um, this is the Mountain Air Odor Remover and Disinfectant. I've never used this one before, but I have a dog if you didn't know. So I thought this would be perfect for getting rid of any doggy smells. This is Mrs. Hinch has been using this exact scent. So I thought I would give it a try. That Mountain Air Sephora was £3.99 from B&M. It was one penny cheaper than Wilkinson's. The next item I got was this flash floor cleaner. I actually had to use this the other day because when I was doing my cleaning. It's mandarin and cedarwood. I'm not a big fan of this scent to be honest, but it said it was the UK's number one floor cleaner so I thought I'd give it a go. Um, I have tiles and wooden floors in my house and I do like to use a proper mop bucket and mop. Um, so this works really well for use in there. I'm not 100% sold on that, so if any of you have any really good floor cleaner recommendations, let me know what they are. I do love a proper mop bucket, uh, but let me know what you put in your mop bucket. What's your secret ingredients? 
My mother-in-law swears by bleach, but I don't know, I think that's a bit strong for all your flaws. The next item I got was this magic eraser. If you follow me already, you might know that on Instagram the other day, Rosalie drew all over my white walls with an ink pad and I couldn't get it off. I tried baby wipes, I tried soap and water. I didn't want to scrub too hard and get the paint off. Well, loads of you actually on my Instagram suggested a magic eraser. It worked like a dream and it got all the ink off. So I was really pleased about that. It's now looking a little worse for wear, so I've got some more just to have in the house for any emergencies. This was a two pack and it was only £1.50. What a bargain. Another bottle of Sephora. I've actually got rid of the box because this was in my cupboard. Um, but I bought this the day before I went to B&M in Wilkinson's and this was £4. Um, this is my favourite scent, Blue Bell Wood. I love it. It's safe to say I'm fully stocked up on Sephora. And when I was in B&M, I saw these like Christmas scents, winter spice and cranberry and orange. Like how, can you imagine how good these smell? I didn't even smell them. I just knew they were going to be amazing. These were one pound each. And obviously I got two because I thought, they it does say that they're limited edition and I thought they would go out of stock like cause everyone will be buying them near Christmas. So I got them to save for Christmas time. The next item I got was this two kilo tub of Astonish Oxy Action. I always use Vanish normally, but it's really expensive. You don't get much in a pot. I couldn't believe how big this tub was. It's two kilos. This is another thing that Mrs. Hinch swears by. So I thought if it's good enough for her, it's good enough for me. I have to give it a go. And this was 2 99 for this huge pot, which I think is such good value. Even the little scoop in there isn't as big as a Vanish scoop either. So you're actually using less product each time. So yeah, if this works as well as the Vanish, I'm definitely going to be buying this more in the future because as I said, it's only 2 99 for this huge tub. And that was from B&M. The next items I got were these tumble dryer sheets. I did have some, but I actually used them all in Mrs. Hinch's famous tumble dryer and Zaflora hack. So basically what she does is she soaks tumble dryer sheets in Zaflora overnight and then in the morning she pops them all over her house to keep her house smelling fresh. She puts them behind her sofa, in her cushion covers, in the bin to stop the bin smelling. Like such a good idea. I think this is an amazing hack. When I tried it I was definitely a convert. I thought this is brilliant. So I had to purchase some more tumble dryer sheets so I can get Hinch in my home some more next week. Those tumble dryer sheets were £2.49 from B&M. The next item I got was a pack of antibacterial wipes just for those like horrible jobs that you don't want to be using your dishcloth for. Controversially, I am a dishcloth fan. Let me know if anyone else feels the same. The nasty jobs that I don't want to be using my dishcloth for, I use these antibacterial wipes and these are 50p from Wilco's. This is a Mrs. Hinch favourite. It is the Flash Bathroom with Febreze. I thought I would give it a try. I'm always up for improving my cleaning routine if I can. Anything that makes my life easier is a winner in my opinion. So yeah, I thought I'd give this a go. This was one pound from B&M. The last two things are from Wilkinson's. I got this bicarb of soda. This was 175 from Wilkinson's and I got some white vinegar spray. This was to do my sinks as Mrs. Hinch does. I'm gonna be doing these later today, so I will film it on my Instagram stories. So if you wanna know what I do with these to keep my plug holes feeling fresh, head over to my Instagram and check out my Instagram stories. I'll save it as a highlight, plug hole clean. <laughs> Just white vinegar and bicarb of soda, and it is so effective. The white vinegar was one pound, and the bicarb of soda was one pound seventy-five. So that is it. That is the end of my cleaning haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the products that I picked up in my Wilkinsons and B and M haul. I've been doing lots of cleaning around my home, so if you love cleaning inspo, head over to my Instagram. I'll link it. Take a look at all my cleaning stories. I've been going wild lately. I'll also link to Mrs. Hinch and Carly, who I mentioned in this video, in the description bar below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.